Hey, what's up guys? It's Jared from Palm Beach County Bootcamp, and this is your benchmark workout. This will be done the 1st and 15th of each month. Now, this was prepared by a bunch of trainers and we discussed it. This is gonna be a gauge for your fitness level and it's super important you don't miss these days. And how it works, guys, is there's gonna be three divisions. The RX, the RX Intermediate, and the RX Beginner, all right? So what we're gonna do is break down these exercises. Chris and Zach are gonna show you exactly what you need to be doing. And it is going to be a one mile run for the RX Division a one mile run for the intermediate, and a three lap run for the beginners. And now there's gonna be some differences in the exercises, but most of them are gonna be pretty uh, the same all the way through. So guys, this is gonna be on the 1st and 15th of each month. So please do not miss tomorrow's workout. Hey guys, it's Chris and Zach, and we're gonna run you through the RX version of our benchmark workout. After your mile run, you've got 20 wall ball shots with either a 20 pound medicine ball or a 16 pound medicine ball. Standards all the same here. Make sure your hip crease drops below your knee and you must hit your target, otherwise it is a no rep. After your 20 wall ball shots, you step off and you've got 20 burpees. Nothing new here to anybody. Chest has to hit the ground as you explode up and you clap up overhead. Hey guys, so after your burpees, you're gonna be coming over to box jumps. For uh, men's and women's standard, men will be going up to the top 24 box. Ladies will be going to a 20 inch box. All right, notice he extends his hips and he fully locks his legs at the end of every jump. He's gonna have 20 of these. And then from there, we'll be going to kettlebell swings. That'll be the next exercise. Men will have 50 pounds for this RX standard. And women will have 35 pounds, again, 20 of these. After your kettlebell swings, guys, you've got 20 toes to bar for the men's and women's RX version. As you see, Zach jumps up onto the bar, he extends his shoulders back using a slight kipping motion. Toes much reach up and touch the bar, otherwise it is a no rep. After your 20 toes to bar, you have a 45 plate walking lunge, 20 reps is there as well. You can either hold the plate in front of your chest or you can hold the plate up overhead. Either way, knee has to touch the ground. You must rotate which foot you are stepping with on each of your 20 reps. All right guys, so we're with Chris again. He's gonna be uh, to push presses after the walking lunges. All right, for the men, they're gonna use the 45 pound barbell from the shoulders, rack position. He pops up to locked arms. Notice the biceps cross the ears and the head leans through. That's a good rep. And he will have 20 of these. After completing that, he will have 50 double unders. So he'll get a rope. And after he's finished 50, he will move on. All right guys, so that is our benchmark workout. And after you're done with your workout, what you're gonna do is record your time. You're gonna actually print it out. We have the markers above right here. Name and time, same deal with the intermediate and the beginner, all right? And what we're gonna do is record this in a log and save it on the computer so in two weeks we can reference back to it. It's really important that you have these numbers so you know a gauge, once again, where your fitness level is at. Um, once again, too, is we wanna explain that if you're a beginner and you're on the level of going to the intermediate, the trainers are gonna tell you to go to the intermediate. So we'll figure that out tomorrow when we get started. Look forward to this workout, guys. It's gonna be awesome.